A desperate search in Natick tonight for a missing kayaker. Helicopters, dive teams, and rescue boats all trying to find that person in Lake Kachichuit. Good evening to you. I'm Ken McLeod. Rescuers have been on scene for roughly three and a half hours now. Let's get right out to our WBZ's Tammy Mutasa. She is live in Natick for us tonight. Tammy? All of these first responders are looking for that. Ken, well, people who use this lake tell me they have never seen a scene quite like this before, and they do hope for a positive outcome because first responders have been here for several hours. And you can see right behind me here, rescuers are still on scene, and they have this whole area blocked off as they search for that missing kayaker. Now, Natick firefighters say they are actively trying to rescue someone from the water here on Lake Kachichuit. Rescuers say that person is on the southern part of the lake and right now a state dive team is combing through the water and a state helicopter was here searching from the air now the mbta worcester commuter rail line has been experiencing major delays in both directions due to this rescue now we talked to boaters who say that this part of the lake does get busy with boat traffic which can create a lot of turbulence on the water they are shocked to see the scene tonight take a listen I mean, it's definitely pretty scary. I mean, like, seeing a lake like that's been in my town for so long, not really, you know, nothing ever like this has really happened. Um, but, you know, I've gone fishing in a lake, I've gone swimming in a lake, and the conditions don't ever seem to be, you know, too bad or anything like that. Um, but it's definitely pretty scary to see somebody, especially like we heard possibly a kayak incident, like just not being able to swim to one end if they fell in the middle, because it definitely is big enough if you're not a good enough swimmer to, you know, have some issues with that. And back out here live, you can see still very much an active scene as rescuers try to find this missing kayaker. They've been out there for several hours, going on to four hours now. Now, they are asking people to avoid this area as they continue on on this mission to find this missing kayaker. You know, again, rescuers are asking people to just stay out of this area so they can do their work and hoping for a positive outcome tonight. But for now, live and native. Tammy Mutasa, WBZ News. All right.